Okay, we are back at our trusty test track because I've discovered some new ways of going on industrial action. Or at least some options. Now, that's the thing I like about Pursuit, and I hope you guys like it too, is that Pursuits do not have a direct route. They're not perfect. So, even if I give you the best, optimal, fastest way of doing things, it doesn't mean that it's absolutely necessarily the fastest and the best way to go. The idea that other people are on the track, this is why I hate Get Trucked, is because Get Trucked has one big long straightaway at the beginning, and you have a ton of other people that are hitting cop cars and hitting each other and just being idiots. Remember that hitting other people just ruins your race as well as theirs, so it doesn't really do you any benefit, but I, this message doesn't go out to everybody, so... When you're doing that, that race, you end up banging into other people, and the idea of being able to kind of, I want to say, keep your nose clean is important, and kind of feeling out how the race guys and the other people will compete will go. So that's the idea, is this, there is no perfect path, but there is kind of like an optimal path, a path that I keep taking over and over again that always gets me results, and that was something we did in the other video. We did industrial action before, but I wanted to come back to it and kind of show you uh, kind of the optional ways of doing this and what I ended up finding out was is there is an, even a better optional way and also a way that I guess is more optimal like there was a lazy way I was doing it and I don't want to be lazy anymore I want to show you the best possible route and uh, get you out there being the fastest you can possibly be so you can see that was the first option right there was going through that area and taking that route. Now, I tested it a couple of times the other way, and the more I continued to test it, the more I kind of saw the best results going this route. This is the other one here. You gotta be careful about that tree, it'll lift you up. So get off the gas when you're on it. But the more I did this, see the little opening there? The more I did that that way, the more I was able to get ahead of people and get a the, a better chance of getting there. And it's the other thing, too, is that some of these routes are not just about being fast. It's being less risky, which is why this path, and I'm seeing more and more of you folks taking it, which is great news, taking this kind of, I want to say, safe route here. And it really is the safer of the routes, and I have a lot of fun with it. So go this way, cut in between these. And then you do this. Now, this is it different from the way we took the original course. And this is another example of up here of where you can, you know, keep your nose clean by going a different route. Is yes, you can take that right right there if you want. I kind of just stick to the path that kind of works with me. And that is, I think that's, that's the other thing is, is if you really have to just kind of fall back. Some of you guys are still going straight. And I've seen a lot of people that are competing against me by doing that. I just tend to get, a, I want to say a couple of tenths of a second faster on this route right here. And it's just because I can get a lot more steam when I'm going this way. I think that there is probably a better route here. But until I find it, I'm not going to be able to say much for it. So you guys out there, if you find something better for me, by all means, show it to me. Put a video up there. So this was the one that really is counterintuitive. Normally you go straight here, but what I found out is you can really kind of cut that turn, and right here is even slower, but where you make it up is at the end here because this last turn down here, it really does slow you down more than you think. And I didn't realize that like taking this turn really is the the be all end all of that track. Especially momentum going into the last turn is huge. So that's our new direction. I hope you guys like it. I hope it works for you. Try it out for yourself. See which is faster. And like I said, don't just trust me. You know, bring it out there, test it yourself. You know, post in the comments. Let me know which way is faster. We'll see you guys soon. Have a great day. Check these other videos out and have a great day. Bye.